Rose, it is not here. Look again, it has to be. Rose, I have read every one ad in the paper. Mine is not here. Are you sure you dropped it over at the newspaper office? Dorothy, you told me exactly what you wanted me to do a dozen times. Any idiot could have done I know, honey, but you were the only one going down. Are you sure that you dropped it off at the newspaper office? Yes, six people already called while you were out. Give that to me, I'll try to find it. Dorothy, have we met? Not yet. I'm here because of your ad in the paper. Willing to do anything, $8 an hour, no job too big or small. Yes, yes, of course, please come in. I'm sorry, I didn't expect people to actually come here. I just figured, you know, that I would be going to them. That's the way it'll work in the future, when my video camera gets back from the shop. <laughs> so tell me, what type of work is it that you need done, Mr. Um, Toto? Mr. Toto. Oh, no, Mr. Just Toto. You're Dorothy, and I'm Toto. <laughs> for the next eight dollars <laughs> dorothy you owe me an apology your ads right here oh rose this is the personals column so what so much you put an ad in the personals column that said i will do anything for eight dollars an hour <laughs> it's right under an ad that reads history professor seeking non-smoking oriental woman who is into wesson oil and bears a resemblance to florence henderson <laughs> Sign Doug. Yes. I know him. He's a sick man. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry for this mix-up. Goodbye. Oh my god, I don't believe it. I'm gonna call the cops if you don't get out of here right away, you pervert. Sorry, I promised I will say Hail Marys until Madonna has a hit movie. Hi, here's my eight dollars. Let's get started, Dorothy. Oh, I'm not Dorothy. She is. I'll give you four dollars. Let's get started. How would you like your rear end kicked across the street? Oh, great. Here's the other four dollars. <laughs>